Hi, welcome to online EasyNet free coaching. Already I have discussed in December 2005 uh, lecture part 1, part 2 in question number 1 to question number 20. Today I will discuss question number 21 to 30. Look at question number 21. In what tree for every node the height of its left subtree and right subtree differs at least by 1? binary search tree, AVL tree, threaded binary tree and complete tree. First of all, look at all the definition of all the trees. First tree is AVL tree. AVL tree is a binary tree in which the height of the left and right subtree of the root differs at most one in which the left and right subtree are again AVL tree. Means what? In AVL tree, left and right of the subtree all differs at most one means always it root node is zero and uh, left if it is a uh, uh, le left tree is if it is not there it is minus one if it is right subtree if it is not there means minus two you know already what is evl tree and binary tree binary search tree is a binary tree that is either empty or in which each node contains a key that satisfies the following conditions means binary search tree it is a tree means it should holds all the conditions of tree and uh, three more conditions first one is all keys in the left subtree of the root precedes the key in the root and the key in the root precedes all keys in its right subtree and the left and right subtree of the root are again search tree means first of all it should holds all the conditions of tree then it should satisfy three more conditions uh, for all already I have read these three conditions so this is a binary tree uh, this is threaded binary tree these special pointers are called threads and the binary tree having such pointers is called threaded binary tree means what in it is also a binary tree but it is special pointer pointing to the nodes that is called thread so it is a threaded binary tree uh, and last one you know complete binary tree it should uh, for all the levels are equal so look at the question in, in what tree for every node the height of its left and left subtree and right subtree differs at least by one that is uh, for the looking all these definitions that is you can answer easily that is question answer number B question number 22 a hash function f defines f of key key mod 7 which linear probing it is used to insert the key uh, some numbers into the table index from 0 to 6 what will be the location of 11 same question it is asked in 2011 already have discussed but uh, look at one second first number is 37 mod is 7 so 37 mod 7 is um, remainder is 2 so similarly 38 uh, 7 2s are 14 7 4s are 28 7 5s are 35 means the uh, remainder is 2 now 38 is remainder is 3 similarly 72 is remainder is 2 means but already second location is allocated so uh, next second and third position is already allocated so next free location is 4 because already second location is allocated and third location is allocated next free location is 4 means 72 allocates for fourth location then 48 mod 7 7 7 is a 42 remainder is 6 so 48 is allocated for sixth position 98 is uh, it is divides uh, 7 this is uh, 10 uh, 7 into 14 is 98 so remainder is 0 means it allocates 0 2 3 4 6 and 0 so now 11 mod 7 is 4 means 4 is allocated but uh, location number is 5 because 4 is already allocated when 72 is allocated 4 so 4 is already allocated so uh, 11 is uh, placed to 5th 
fifth location. The free location after four is five. So this is answer is hash function index table eleven. This is eleven. In what position it is placed? That is five. So answer is C. Consider the graph. Which of the following is a valid topological sorting? First, you need to understand this simple uh, definition of if you know the topology. What is topological sorting? Then you can answer this question easily. First, we we'll look at what is the topological sorting. Topological sort and the directed acyclic graph. It uh, topological sorting. It is applicable only directed and cyclic graph. Uh, sorry, acyclic graph. Is a linear ordering of all vertices such that an edge U V in G appears in such a way that U appears before V in the ordering. This is a topological sorting. It is applicable only directed acyclic graph. In this graph, find the topology. Means uh, sorting. This starts with A, B. Then, if you select C, there is no way for D. So A. B, D, C. A, B, D, C. So answer is D. It's a very simple question. I hope you understood this one. Answer is D. First of all, you should understand what is topological sorting technique. If you know that one, you can answer this question easily, like these questions. So next one, the initial configuration of Q is A, B, C, D. A is the at front to get the configuration. D, D, C, B, A. How many deletions and additions are required? Okay, it's a very interesting question. This is initially initial configuration of Q is A, B, C, D, and uh, front is position to first position that is A. So now uh, next you need to get a configuration D, C, B, A means reverse D, C, B, A. For that, first you need one deletion and one addition for stack. So one deletion, one addition. Then, then second deletion and second addition. Then third deletion and third addition for this stack. And uh, just fetch the data as one second. D C B A. This is an you will get an order. So again, pop the elements in the stack. You get the, the configuration D C B A. So we get configuration B C D A. We need three additions and three deletions. So answer is D. I hope you understood this question. It's very simple. Just uh, you need to understand and uh, try to solve this type of questions. Looking like difficult, but it's very easy if you know how to tackle this type of questions. Which traversal technique is the least the nodes of the binary search tree in ascending order? Actually, you know you try to know the all the definitions of uh, uh, pre order, post order, and in order. Uh, actually, post order is first it left right root. This pre order is root left right. If it is a tree, root left right. So this is in order left root right. So to first traversal of left tree, then it's root and right, because which traversal technique leads the nodes of the binary search tree in ascending order? Actually, binary search tree always left of the tree is smaller than uh, root node, and root is smaller than right of the tree. So obviously, left root right, left root right is in order. So answer is. In order technique. Okay. Next, the data unit in the TCP/IP application layer is called. Actually, it is a message, but you I have listed all the data units because it may ask next time what is the data unit of uh, presentation layer, what is the data unit of transport layer. So just look at data unit of application layer is called data or message data unit. In transport layer is segment data unit in network layer is bucket data unit in data link layer is frame uh, data unit in physical layer is bits. So now you can answer this question easily. The data unit in the TCP/IP application layer is called message. 
because application layer data unit is message okay now look at next question so answer is a look at next question which of the following file retrieval method use hypermedia means how which uh, media used to retrieve the files you can answer easily html it is a uh, hypertext language it is not used it is to, used to develop uh, or known unica and wais actually you know already http hypertext transport protocol it is used to retrieve the methods using hypermedia Hyper uh, hypertext transfer protocol is an application protocol for distributed collaborative and hypermedia information system. HTTP is the foundation of data communication for the world wide web. For uh, if you want more about this one, just go through this link. So, which of the following file retrieval method used for hypermedia? That is, answer is P. Okay. Uh, if you have any queries anything just mail me look at the next question 28 which of the following is an example of client server model actually uh, in this given dns domain name uh, service and uh, file transport protocol and telnet and all the above actually which of the following is an example of client server model main sort which is the example using for client server so dns that is also used in client server ftp file transport protocol this is also working on client server model so definitely uh, if i know all two options definitely it is all of these so telnet also used in a file server model so which of the following is an example of clients client server model is all of these if you have if you want more about this question just go through this link okay uh, if you have any queries anything just mail me please subscribe the channel please promote inform your friends um, if you encourage me i can develop next videos uh, some of you mailed me uh, you are facing for uh, in uh, rural and remote areas youtube access so if it is uh, i am thinking to develop uh, made some videos uh, video CDs I can send in CD also uh, in future I am thinking about that we'll see uh, for your response if it is um, if you need in CD I can send in CD also so I anyhow you need to uh, con just mail me and comment me in YouTube comment box for any queries okay next look at uh, question number 29 points provide a method to recover data that has been delivered but not yet used dash points provide a method to recover data that has been delivered but not used means segmentation and concatenation translation and synchronization actually concatenation you have used to concat translation this is also not suitable so synchronization a uh, synchro uh, synchronization points provide a method to recover data from delivered been delivered but not yet used means what synchronization is used for uh, synchronizing the packets in a messages so what is synchronization synchronization networks are also often known as network of uh, coupled dynamics dynamical systems both of these refer to networks connection oscillators where oscillators are nodes that emit a signal with somewhat regular possibly variable frequency and are also capable to receive a signal so it is a regular signal with a somewhat regular means oscillates it synchronizes the total message i hope you understood what i am trying to explain uh, this is uh, synchronization method points to provide a method to recover a data that has been delivered but not at used okay the uh, for 29th question in december 2005 uh, answer is d look at 30th question encryption decryption are the functions of the dash layer of osi model 
actually you can this one this question asked in three to four time in UGC net uh, previous question papers and also uh, gate exam also so it's very important questions many time asked it's a straightforward question uh, encryption and description happens in a presentation checks in a presentation layer but anyhow you, you try to know the uh, what is the uh, functions of all the layers so application layer is network process to application this is uh, for this image you can understand all the functions of all the layers actually physical uh, physical layer is media and signal binary transmission this is the function and data link layer physical addressing that is the function so network path determination and logical addressing and transport layer end to end connection and reliability and flow control in transport layer so session interhost communication and messaging um, messaging sessions between applications data representation encryption and decryption convert uh, machine dependent to the uh, data to machine independent data that is also the function of presentation layer application layer is network process to application so question is encryption decryption are functions of osi model this is uh, sorry presentation layer oh, encryption decryption function of presentation layer so option is answer is d so thank you for watching uh, please uh, subscribe the channel and inform your friends thank you one at all